What's going on, moms and dads? So, I always find it difficult to try to make videos because I feel like the way I express myself isn't always the best. At least that's what I'm told, and I believe it as well. I know I'm very harsh, very direct, very mean, much of an asshole, whatever you want to call it, right? But I found this video, and I'm going to let sis cook, talk, you know what I'm saying, and do her thing because she says everything that I feel to a T in a funny, sarcastic, you know what I'm saying, type of way. So, I'm gonna let that play. I'm gonna come back, give a little bit of input. You swallowed that man's DNA last night, but you can't drink apple cider vinegar to suppress your appetite and control your blood sugar so you can burn fat. Oh, okay. And I also heard you be getting your back beat at 2 30 in the morning at your sneaky link house, but you can't get to the gym at 4 a.m. in the morning. Oh, okay. Y'all spend hours at the hair salon, the nail shop, and all that old jazz, but you can't take an hour to meal prep. Oh, okay. Now, you said that you was going to do your research on how to lose weight and what foods you need to eat, but the only thing up in your search bar is Pornhub. Oh, okay. You can be committed to a man that gave you BV 75 times, but you can't commit to going to the gym and eating in a calorie deficit. Oh, okay. You claim you want a fat ass, but yet you still sitting on the damn couch with your foot crossed watching something on Tubi and eating potato chips all day, strolling through TikTok. Oh, okay. That's what it sound like to me when y'all be telling me y'all ain't got time to take care of yourself. <laughs> so, you heard sis cook, you heard her talk, you heard her spit, and this is obviously a family channel. I'm trying to cater to parents, fathers, in specific, you know what I'm saying? But it's not just about you. The very thing that you are or not doing is affecting your children. You feel me? The very thing that you neglect to do is the very same thing your kids are gonna neglect to do. If they're watching you sit on the couch eating junk food, that's the very same thing your kids are gonna do. And I feel like for a man or even for women, right? That man, you need to find purpose. You need to find things to do. You need to keep those idle hands busy. I know those hands wanna do all types of dirty, all types of lazy, but you need to fight against those urges to do absolutely nothing to eat absolute garbage and go the other direction. You need to tell your mind, body, and soul to connect, to integrate, to work together for the benefit of your body, soul, heart, everything. Because in turn, as you're filling your cup, you'll be able to pour into your kids. I'm a big, big advocate of filling your cup first and then filling your kids, pouring into your kids. No dirty type of shit. <laughs> on a dark humor side and it's just funny and i feel like man men and women have lost their ways we're so content so stagnant and we're just laying around doing nothing so accustomed to you know what i'm saying binge watching tv so accustomed to scrolling through tiktok for hours if your kid disrespecting you not showing you no no type of love no type of attention because the head is down looking at their phone that's your own fault take accountability this isn't your kid's fault. It's your own fault. We can do better. Set a higher standard for yourself and for your kids on what y'all gonna eat, what y'all gonna watch, how we gonna, what are y'all gonna do. This is how we're gonna elevate. This is how we're gonna build legacy. This is how we're gonna better ourselves 1% every fucking day. You feel me?